Here I'm taking Makeup Forever's HD Foundation in Y35 and I'm mixing it with Mehron's Paradise Paint in white to create that very pale zombie-like skin that Olivia has. Taking Urban Decay's Eye Primer Potion, I'm going to put that all over the lid and get it ready for the eyeshadows. Then I'm going to take Creme Brulee by Makeup Geek Cosmetics and I'm going to just dust this all over the lid. It doesn't have to be completely perfect. Olivia has a lot of reds and uh, purples in her eyes, so I'm going to take Bitten, also by Makeup Geek Cosmetics, and I'm going to be placing that in the crease, and I'm just going to be brushing it outwards. Taking Urban from Urban Decay's Electric Palette, I'm going to be placing this purple in the eye just to create kind of a pop, and then I'm going to take Center Stage by Makeup Geek Cosmetics, and I'm going to be placing that inside of the crease, and then blending it outwards actually with Bitten to create this kind of purpley, reddish mixture of colors. To smooth everything out, I'm going to take Beaches and Cream by Makeup Geek Cosmetics and I'm just going to fan that all the way up to my eyebrow and then I'm going to take Stila's Smudge Pencil and I'm going to line my upper and lower lashes and then I'm going to smudge that out with that urban color from the electric palette. Taking Bitten, again, I'm going to be dusting it in these areas to create that zombie, tired, I haven't slept, basically I'm not even alive look. I'm not sure what color this is, but it's from a palette from MAC, and it is just kind of a grayish, brownish color. Um, I'm going to be using that to contour the sides of my nose, um, inside my cupid's bow, underneath my lip, and the sides of my cheeks, just to create um, that hollowed out kind of look that she has going on there. Taking a little bit of cover-up, I'm just going to clean up a little bit of the areas and highlight a little bit. I'm not sure what brand this is, but it's called Berry Nude K145. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, I met my friends, so I was using some of her makeup. But she has this kind of pinkish, nudish color. Very, very, very light nude color. I'm going to be placing that along my lips, and then I'm just going to take whatever cover-ups left on that beauty blender, and I'm just going to rub it all over into my lips to create kind of a washed out kind of look. And then I'm going to take this color, I believe it's Urban as well, or it's the one beside it, which I think is called Jilted. One of those two colors, I'm just going to be placing it in the centers of my lips and dragging it out from the corners just to create kind of that dead look again. Obviously, Liv is a zombie. Then I'm going to take mascara, it doesn't matter what kind, I'm using Benefit They Are Real, and you're going to be placing this on your top and bottom lashes. Taking Anastasia's Dip Brow in Ash Brown, I'm going to start filling in my eyebrows. Then I'm going to take some natural looking lashes and apply them. I believe these are by Ardell. Um, and then that's it. That's the complete look. I hope that you guys liked it. If you haven't watched iZombie yet, you should check it out. It's a really, really, really good show. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know in the comments down below what look you would like me to do next.